for an event like this, um, I want to talk through like how to actually plan it. So for an Oktoberfest event, there are a couple of key things that you need in order to really create that feeling that your residents have traveled to Munich and are enjoying it. And again, the preference to this is this does require a little bit of work. So we recommend that for this event, you really plan it ahead as far as you can. So the first and most important element is the beer selection. So Oktoberfest is all about the beer selection. So you want to offer a variety of classic German brews. And these are all things that you can pick up at your local grocery, or if you hire a caterer, uh, you can help, you can have them like bring. So the beer selection is definitely the most important thing. You can kind of ignore everything else on this list, uh, but if you have like a really great beer selection, then that's all you really need for the event. So that's one. Uh, the second thing you need for the event is food. Um, so it's probably not a good idea to have your residents drinking a lot uh, without something to eat. So we recommend you have um, all like the traditional German spreads. So from delicacies to pretzels, sausages, and sauerkraut. Um, so have those options for them to grab and eat. So a fun way to uh, make this event last much longer during the day. And then uh, you can't have an Oktoberfest without traditional like German desserts, uh, like uh, the Black Forest cake, apple strudel, and donuts. So highly recommend you include some of these uh, to make this event even more fun. And then uh, a way to really create uh, that environment of Oktoberfest is to have live music. You can get by with a DJ, uh, but really recommend uh, live music because it's going to bring people out and have them like stay much longer. And it just creates a much better environment. So the live music element is also important. And then to really, really take it over the top, uh, you could have your resident, you can recommend that your residents really dress up. So um, a lot of residents might find this fun uh, to have that opportunity to uh, dress like Germans. Um, so they can go to a local costume shop to pick up uh, different like, materials. Um, so another way to take this event from pretty good to amazing is by encouraging residents to dress fancy for the event. And then it also makes it super picturesque. Um, so you can have a lot of great pictures that you can use on social media. So this would recommend would recommend this to be your a marquee event for the fall. Um, so a nice one that you can really have a lead up to. And then uh, finally, uh, to really take this even more is to have games and contests. So you can do a lot of things on here. Uh, it could be traditional German games, or it could be as simple as uh, corn, uh, cornhole. Uh, so just a way to keep people engaged throughout the festival. And this is also another event where you we recommend that you invite prospects to. So again, that allows you to tie in your engagement to uh, conversions and leasing. And this is also something that will then get you a much larger budget. So rather than spend a thousand dollars on um, a discount for rent, you can put some of that to uh, an event to get more foot traffic. So something else that we would recommend. So uh, as you know, Oktoberfest is from September 16th to about October 3rd this year. So that's kind of the time frame where you want to host it. So if this is an event you want to do, uh, we recommend you start planning as early as you can. 